Hi everyone. I just wanted to come on this afternoon and and show you this incredible package that I got. I did peek because it was totally not what I was expecting. Um, Becky McCauley, who is Aunt Bex Creations on YouTube and on Facebook, uh, and I are partic were participating in Lisa Conway, who is Lisa My Eclectic Life on YouTube and on Facebook. We are doing a, a ATC coin swap. So it's artist trading coins. And so I was expecting a little package from Becky with, with artist trading coins in it. And uh, instead, this huge, huge package full of stuff came, and it's like, oh my goodness. So, uh, Becky, thank you. It's so truly amazing. But I just wanted to pop in and open things and show you everything because it's just, I didn't really look. When I saw what it was, I sort of touched it back in the tucked it back in the envelope and so anyways uh and i'm pretty sure there's some trading coins in here but she sent some washi tape this one says amazing it's red and says amazing i don't know that you'll be able to see that this one is orange with little black um let's see little black sort of V's in it. Really cool. And then in this one, she sent a little rubber stamp that has such, it's got, it's so cute. It's got lips. Can you see that? It's lips. And that'll be fun to kiss packages with. And here's another thing of washi tape. Oh, this one's got leaves. I, I thought it was just a design when I peeked at it, but it's actually sort of a leaf. What I like best is the $100,000 that she sent. Um, because, you know, I could use $100,000, and a $100,000 bill ought to be that big anyways. So that is too fun. And she sent this beautiful artist trading coin. And she, Becky packages things so pretty. I, I uh, honestly, the way mine got sent was in some pretty envelopes, but at the same time, nothing like this. These are beautiful, Becky. Just gorgeous. And it says, as the leaves turn, Becky. This is number two of three. Oh, I think she made a series of these it says everyone must take the time to sit and watch the leaves turn and there's table scatter underneath this pretty paper flower with a jewel and this cute little wooden house and more table scatter up there and she's topped the bag with um, burlap so that's really cool and then this is a card and I'm pretty sure it's from one of her, she did some oh, Dirty Dozens with um, and turned things into cards. And it's just beautiful. It says hello down here and it has, it's, you guys, I know you can't see it, but it's got beautiful texture in it. So she must have used some texture paste. I forget which, which Dirty Dozen she used, uses. I watch and then I forget I'm not very good about that but then it's got these beautiful leaves on it too so really pretty and and I thought we were only supposed to send four cards but Becky sent me five or four trading coins but Becky sent me five and they're just gorgeous um these are fall and again she's put the table scatter this all sealed in such pretty little bags and this trim and it says autumn paints in colors the summer has never seen and there is nothing quite like a fall day and these are just gorgeous guys there's so much detail 
there's little pin stitching around the edges and there's layers there's there's burlap and then some other kind of sparkly netting type stuff and a pretty gold leaf before the butterfly and the flower and the same is true over here there's loads of layers in it so pretty and then these are totally different they're not fall they're more spring and this one's really beachy and look how she put it on top of one of those paper doilies just just it's like the artist trading coins are a presentation in themselves I'm just I'm just looking at all the layers of colors and Becky these are beautiful and these have little die cuts in them and this one's got a little bug on a, on the coin those are gorgeous just gorgeous it all sealed up with glitter tape too oh my just so pretty and then there was this big fat bag in there and um, she sent a whole stack of gorgeous napkins um, this one it was really interesting I don't think I have a single one of these I, I really don't I don't think I, that I have this one but it's in a larger size it's not as delicate and pretty as this one, little one is I much prefer the little one and the rest of them I don't think I have a single one of them so this is a beautiful peacock and this is so cool with the um, the arc arch and this I've never seen this size before this is so cute it says love it looks very 60s and flower powery it's really cute and this one's wine and cheese. Oh, it, let's see. It has a, it looks like it's a whole tablescape. Isn't that cool? Oh, and this one is just, it's like an owl printed on a, a book page. So pretty. And that is just delicate and it has the scalloped edges. And this is another beachy themed one which is really pretty too. It's got stamps and it's it has a postmark that is a shell. Becky, these are beautiful. And this one, oh, this one's lovely. Mm, yummy fall colors. This is another size I don't think I've ever seen. These are, she's got a couple of sizes in here I've, I don't think I've ever seen. I have some that are bigger than this, but they're they call them guest towels or something but this one is really pretty this is and it's a smaller size which is it, it sometimes the smaller ones are so much prettier because they're more delicate now that's interesting that's about the size of a large one but folded into a small one so that's cool just really really cool and this one is the lucky raven elixir bottled in grim falls oh that's really cool oh and there's a spider on the back it says spider cider that's cool and another beachy one and the dark 
Oh, and this is another one of that smaller size that's really cool. Look at the roses. I'm going to have to put one of these in my um, altered book I'm working on for sure. And, um, we have these here. I can't remember what they're called. It's not wisteria. It's Sometimes they're pink and sometimes they're purple and sometimes they're blue. It depends on where they're growing and what the soil is. And this one's so funny. These fish are playing cards. Oh my, this fish is... I don't know. Maybe he's not happy with his hand. Oh, this one's interesting. It has, has a lot of different scenes in it. And some bumblebees. I love this one, Becky. This one is so cool. This is a big black skull. Well, it's a white skull on black. Really cool. And this one looks so old-timey. There are dogs watching the cow, the sheep. They're watching sheep. Oh, no, maybe they're hunting because this dog over here is pointing. Oh, and pretty, pretty roses. And pink flamingos. I want pink flamingos to put in my yard. You know, they're not that easy to find. Of course, I want a big metal chicken, too, but... Oh, well. Oh, and pansies. These are beautiful tulips and pansies. Oh, there's feathers in there, too. They're so pretty. And the bird of paradise. Oh, and some more roses. What, what is interesting to me is that uh, I have a lot of napkins. I really do, and I don't have a single one of these. And uh, chickens, how cute. I love the chickens. Anyways, Becky, I, I cannot thank you enough. I can't thank you enough for trading coins with me um, and sending me this beautiful package. And... Please, please uh, enjoy, and everybody have just a wonderful day. Let's find a quote about creativity today. Hmm. Okay, this one is pretty good. It says, although you always have to leave your comfort zone in order to be creative, in the end, creativity will leave you feeling truly in harmony with yourself for the first time. So that is one of our ways to creativity. Anyways, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching. Becky, thank you for this amazing package. Um, please, everybody, have a wonderful day and go make some art. Bye-bye.